Hi, this is Josh Chapman at the 2012 NAMM Show. We're at the Avid booth and I'm joined here by Collier. He's a uh, Pro Tools and console specialist. He's going to tell us a couple of things that's new with Pro Tools 10. Collier? Well, one of the main things with Pro Tools 10 is the new disk cache feature in Pro Tools HD that allows you to basically list, um, import your whole, when you open up your session, it basically loads completely into RAM. So it still has to talk to the drives, but you're basically running off the RAM of your computer, so it's instant play, instant locate. There's never any issue with getting audio from the drives. And part of that, part of that bonus is also the fact that Pro Tools 10 now has real-time fades. So no more fade files, no more pushing and pulling fades back and forth from the drive, no more creating fades. It all does it in real time. We're taking advantage of the high horsepower value of the new CPUs. So the whole fade file issue is not an issue anymore. You can, you can fade things in real time, it, it calculates them in real time, which makes for a faster, more responsive Pro Tools. Along with the disk cache option, it, it makes Pro Tools act like a tape machine only faster. Another bonus of the disk cache feature is it, because it's loading all your audio into RAM, it allows you to use less than optimum storage. You can use USB 2 drives, FireWire drives, actually network attached storage for post facilities is the big bonus. Now all the Media Composer and even Final Cut Pro sessions that all live on a central server, now all the Pro Tools sessions can live there too. So there's not copies locally and back and forth and which one's the latest version. Everything lives on a central server now for post facilities large and small. That's people that they're just they're praising us for that. And it's a really great bonus. A couple other things, uh, clip gain, which allows us to individually uh, gain and, and attenuate clips pre-fader, pre-insert pre point, so, and pre-automation, so you can control your levels even before they get to the fader. Uh, and that, that actual clip gain can be turned into automation, or automation can be flipped into clip gain. Really powerful system. There's a whole bunch of really small features, but what it all adds up to is speed and power. If it can save you an hour a day mixing, five hours a week, 20 hours a month, that equals a lot more work or a lot more time home with your family and still being able to do a great job and have creative time in front of Pro Tools. Well, that sounds very exciting, yeah. Collier. There's a lot, of, uh, a lot of really exciting things on the Thanks, forefront Josh. for Avid. Yeah. Pro Stay Tools tuned can. to Sonic TV for some more updates from 2012 and NAMM. I'm Josh Chapman. Thanks for tuning in to Sonic TV.